is going on everybody? We are back with another video. Just doing an update for you all about Deacon's progress. So this dog is doing awesome. He's really moving fast, faster than I ever imagined that he would be going. So I'm really impressed with how that's going. We're gonna be doing some food reward obedience and also if I can tonight, I'm going to show you all that he is actually fetching a frozen duck. It's a smaller duck, it's a teal. But you gotta start somewhere with as small as he is, he can't pick up a full size mallard, so this teal is perfect practice for him. Enough of me talking, let me show you all the progress that Deacon is making. All right everybody, I have Deacon's food pouch right here. As you can tell, he knows that when we have this, we're doing training, so I don't want him to always associate that only, he's only going to do what I ask him to do when he's getting trained. So what I do, or what I've been doing, is throwing it in my pocket, so that it's gone and he doesn't know it's here anymore. So as you all can see, he is right behind me. He's in an SIT, thinking that if he does that, he's going to get his reward, right? But I don't want him to just automatically think he's gonna get something. The other thing that I'm doing today too, the reason why I keep talking is because I want him to just kind of focus on some other stuff right now. But I've got my duck calls. I'm just gonna casually start kind of working these in so that he doesn't, I want to desensitize him to them so that when we do go duck hunting, when I start blowing on these things, he doesn't start whining or start acting funny. So starting them off early, not super loud, just something pretty quiet. Doesn't even care. Here. Sit. Isn't that cool? Ten weeks old, everybody. He's doing that at ten weeks old. Now, any of you say, "Oh, my puppy's too young. My dog's too young. He just doesn't get it." Just find a way to make them get it. And what I mean by that is that he's a really—he needs a lot of positivity. A lot of labs do. A lot of puppies do. So I make it really positive for him. He knows. I'm just going to spell these out because I don't want him to do them when I say them. But S I T. He knows H E R E. He knows D-O-W-N, that one's still a little tricky. He's kind of still trying to figure that one out. He knows his name. Uh, sorry everybody, I had to take a phone call. Anyways, what I was saying was the things that he knows how to do. So kind of going in repeat here. He knows how to S-I-T, H-E-R-E, D-O-W-N. He knows his name. He knows dead bird. So he's starting to pick these things up so quick he's only 10 weeks old now if you're training dogs or if you have a dog one thing that you need to realize is it's not just the dog it's you as well so if you're consistent if you work with them all the time and take the time to work with them and figure out what motivates them you just have to figure out the best way to train your dog and do it all the time every day you have to especially when they're this young because when they're this young this is when they pick it up anyways so we started introducing this call. He doesn't seem like he even cared about it, which is great. So I'm going to show everybody else the other stuff that he does, okay? Hey, boy. Hey, good boy. Huh? Here. Down. So with that DWN, I know that I'm bent over looking down. I'm gonna be phasing that out, or not phasing that out, sorry. I'm gonna be fading that out eventually. It's just for some reason right now, that's just what's helping him. It started off with my hand being down, my hand coming up, me standing here like this, and now I'm just slowly filtering that out. Look at this cheating. Cheating. You know that? You good boy. So what I'm going to do for the H-E-R-E, -E, just take a little bit of food kibble. Good boy. And when he sees it, here. When he turns, you mark it. Now, I don't know if all of y'all saw that, so I'm going to stand off to the side and do it again.
here. So as you can see, we're moving forward. He's already got a lot of his basic obedience down. We're starting to work him towards the call tonight, just so that he gets desensitized to it. And then uh, once we're done doing food reward, I'm gonna see about taking him outside and working him on the dock. So stay tuned, we're gonna do a little bit more here just so you can all see what I'm doing. doing so far just the basics now when he gets older I'm gonna expect a lot more out of him right now I'm not expecting a whole lot because he's a puppy and really the fact that he's doing all this stuff at 10 weeks old it just mind boggles me so I'm not expecting too much out of him <sighs> So as you can see, he kind of came back to that one, but he didn't bark or whine or anything, so I'm happy with that. And I don't want to do it so much that it stirs him up, so every once in a while, he's just doing his own thing. I'll just do, we'll do a wood duck call. And then when he looks around, just kind of ignore it, let him do his thing. So that's how I'm gonna desensitize him to the call. Anyways, enough of all this stuff. Let's do a little bit of duck retrieve. All right, everybody. Now that Deacon's had time to go outside and poop and pee and get a little bit of energy out, we're now gonna try to incorporate a duck. This is a hen green wing teal. This right here is a duck that we shot this season. I froze it for training purposes for this. So it's a smaller duck, which I like. I'm not expecting too, too much out of him. He just ate. I know this is not the best time to do this, but I wanted to show everybody his progress. If you check out my TikTok or my Instagram or anything, you'll see that he has been fetching this pretty well. But I'm not expecting too, too much tonight, but we're gonna give it a shot anyways. If he doesn't bring, them back, bring it back to me, I'm not super worried about it. I'm just gonna take it away from him, put it out. So as you can see, he wasn't super into the duck tonight. I'm not worried about it at all. And the reason being is because he has been fetching it. It's a little bit on me. He just ate. He's kind of interested in a lot of other stuff. He's a puppy. His attention span is really short. So uh, I'm not gonna try to force that tonight. He did have one little retrieve where he ran away from me with it. Again, not worried about it. He's 10 weeks old. We're gonna work through that. So that's just his progression. As you can see, he can do an SIT, H-E-R-E, D-O-W-N. He knows his name and he does know dead bird fetch. So we're getting through it, we're working it, and he's doing really good. And I couldn't be happier with how he's doing. So thank you all for watching. Thank you for joining our journey. Um, I hope you all are excited as I am, excited as I am to see how he does next fall. So like I said, Thank you for joining. Merry Christmas to you all. Mm -hmm.